You're watching Veg TV. We're going to make savory sweet potato bites. Easy, delicious, perfect for a buffet, great for entertaining. Here's what you do. I always use yams, and you want to choose about two pounds of sweet potatoes, yams that are of uniform size. I've cut them into half inch rounds. They're unpeeled, just like that. And we bake them in the oven at 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. Make sure that they're soft but not mushy. First, we're gonna mix the topping really easy. We're gonna whisk together in a bowl a quarter cup of Veginase. That's vegan mayonnaise. I like Veginase. If you have a favorite, you can use that. And to that, I'm going to add two tablespoons of mellow white miso, two tablespoons of creamy peanut butter, two teaspoons of Marocan rice vinegar, very mild. It's gonna add a delicious tang to this recipe. Two teaspoons of sesame oil, a half teaspoon of ground ginger, and a dash or two of hot sauce. For me, it's two dashes. I'm going to first mix this together a little bit with my spatula like that, and then I'm gonna take a wire whisk I'm gonna whisk it together. Just like that, that's all there is to it. Very easy. These are baked sweet potato rounds, a few of them, and now I'm gonna to top them. That's all there is to it. Just enough, like that. Ah, oh, smells so good. If you don't wanna use peanut butter, if you're allergic to peanuts, you can use tahini. Just a half tablespoon on each sweet potato round, like so. I have some scallions sliced on an angle to garnish with. I'm just gonna add a few like this. Just add a couple, just a little garnish like that. Looks really lovely. Presentation is so important. It actually adds to the taste and the flavor. It certainly adds to the experience when you make food look enticing. And now I have some toasted sesame seeds. I'm just gonna sprinkle them on like that. Mmm, that looks amazing. And that's all there is to it. Savory sweet potato bites. Great for entertaining, great for a snack, great anytime. Absolutely delicious, made with Marocan rice vinegar.